so okay greetings so in this lecture what we'll be seeing is we'll be seeing about your uh, three core cables uh, <coughs> also the three core cables with uh, neutral point also we will be seeing so you know about the cables right so in the three core cable you will be having three cores so this three cores generally will be ca carrying your r y b <coughs> so this is your uh, cross sectional view of your uh, three core uh, cable so this three core cable we we'll, we have to find your capacitance so that's our main objective of this lecture so if we are uh, getting with respect to your uh, single core cable if you are uh, clearly clearly understood means uh, surely you can understand about this three core cable so for the capacitance of the three core cable what is that means two insulators are required okay so like uh, in the previous case we have uh, seen with respect to the uh, lead sheet outer lead sheet right so that lead sheet has had one insulator but over here uh, you, you need uh, three uh, sorry two insulators okay you need you are in need of two insulators so here you can see So here you can see the structure. So this is the conductor. <coughs> so inside there will be one insulator <coughs> followed by the belt insulation will be. Okay. So here in a three core cable belted cable, uh, the conductor insulation of thickness T. So the thickness is T and belt insulation of thickness T. So you have to see with respect to this three core. There will be two insulators, and one will be with respect to your uh, conductor insulation. This conductor insulation uh, thickness will be small t, and the belted insulation thickness will be capital T. Okay, so here there will be the possibility to form of three capacitance. So three capacitance uh, uh, are uh, possibly to form between. So where it will be formed means it will be uh, formed between phases. Be formed between phases and are connected uh, in the form of a delta. So here you can clearly see. So this will be in, in a form of a delta connection. Okay. So here between between the conductors between the conductors the capacitance will be CC. Okay, this CC and uh, from the conductors to the outer sheath it will be CE. So here you can see. So it will be CC. This CC will be in, in terms of your delta connection, whereas uh, the capacitance from your conductor to the outer sheath will be in of your uh, star connection. Okay. So you have to arrive at this uh, diagram. After arriving at this diagram, you have to find your equivalent capacitance. Okay, so if you're finding the equivalent capacitance means we'll be getting the capacitance value of this three core conductor. So that's how it goes on. So so this you can convert like this, and finally the equivalent capacitance you'll be getting like this uh, three cc in star connection. Okay, so you'll be applying your star connect uh, that is uh, uh, delta to star. Uh, uh, formula. So after finding this for uh, EZTA, you have to apply your 1 by omega CC. So this EZ is nothing but impedance value. Here the inductance is uh, neglected. Okay, as I said, the cables should be having uh, predominant or more amount of capacitance effect in it. Okay. So now this 1 by C1 equal to 1 by C1 is this C1 is equal to 1 by CC J omega CC into J omega CC. Okay, so again it becomes so you have to it is additive in nature, so you have to add it up. So finally, you'll be getting C1 equal to 3 times of your CC. Okay, so now next is that you have to find for your uh, charging current. So, charging current the same formula. V phase IC equal to V phase by XC. So this XC is nothing but 1 by omega C naught. So after that, you have to apply for this C naught. Okay. So this is how it looks like. 
so how you can measure your ce and uh, cc okay so you know about uh, c what is ce now you know and what is uh, cc you know so how to measure the capacitance of uh, that ce and uh, cc okay so here the conductors uh, are not surrounded by homogeneous insulation this uh, i have uh, uh, at the beginning itself i said uh, will be having two types of insulation so each will be having uh, uh, different uh, epsilon values okay the capacitance cannot be ca calculated by their obtained measurement that, that is by the direct measurement you cannot get the capacitance so there is some uh, other uh, uh, ways to find the capacitance so measure the capacitance cx between sheet 2 and all the three conductors so here the sheet 2 is nothing but your uh, outer sheet so first is that you have to uh, measure with respect to this uh, outer sheath and your core. So here you can see the core 3 core and the outer sheath. So that is uh, first you have to find your CV. So the total uh, capacitance is CX is equal to CE plus CE plus C. That is uh, all the capacitance are in parallel. So if it is parallel means you can directly add your capacitance. So it will be three times of your CE. So now, <clears throat> if you know the value of a CX, you can find CE. So that's what the formula they have given. Next is that, uh, uh, another like, next method is that connect any two cores. Okay. So you have to connect two cores to the sheet. <coughs> so in the previous case, what we done, uh, the conductor. Uh, uh, the capacitance between sheets 2 and all the three conductors we consider now you have to consider the sheet with respect to any two of your uh, uh, cores okay so then what you'll be getting is c this c plus your two times of your cc okay that is one of your c will be replaced by your uh, uh, cc okay Two cores means CC will be coming into the effect. So if you know the value of CX and CY, right? So here it is two equation followed by two unknowns. So then you can easily find out the value of your C. Okay. CX is one unknown, CY is another one unknown. Okay. So with that you can find your CC and then C naught. So C naught is nothing but the overall capacitance. So it is three times of C C plus C E. That's what we have seen in the previous case. Okay. So this is the method uh, to find your capacitance uh, value. Okay, so in this, uh, the main question, what they'll be asking uh, with respect to your one mark means they'll be asking this thing. So what is the uh, capacitance uh, of a three core cable uh, with respect to uh, your uh, cables they'll be asking. And uh, they're asking me see how to write uh, this formula. Okay, so this is what uh, with respect to uh, today's lecture. <coughs> 